we were marking them out here. You know, so it's like they school up and live out here. But they're not there we go. That's got to be a fish. Yeah. That one didn't. I think they have been spitting it, like you're saying. Alrighty, guys. What is going on? We're back. First fishing video of 2020. I'm here with my buddy, Bam Mil Brandon Miller, aka Bam. I always think your name's actually Bam. It might as well be. <laughs> we got Bam here. We're out of his boat. We're not out of the kayak. So a little change of pace, but it should be a fun time. Nice winter day here in Northern California. Today we're just gonna go out fishing. I don't know, what do you think? Jigs, Ned rigs? Big Ned rig, maybe a spoon. Okay. Fish anywhere from like five to 80 feet. So It's a pretty big range. Yeah. So we'll see what happens, but uh, just to, so you guys know, it's two of my favorite rods that I use. Uh, the jig rod, which I'll be throwing today, and then my chatterbait rod. Those rods are made by this dude right here. Guru rods, right? Yes, sir. And I know they're in pretty high demand, so good luck getting one, but I'll link his site in the description below if you're interested. But uh, yeah, I'm going to put a chesty on. I'm going to put a chesty on Bam and uh, see what we can make happen today. Ready? Sure. Come on, man. I should last you the hopefully this one works. My sister got me this camera for Christmas, so really? Bam already I haven't even met a cast yet and Bam's already catching her. Well, alright, that's a good sign. <laughs> alright, Bam's on the board. I haven't even met a cast yet. I'm trying to set up his camera and he's just catching three pound Probably spots. Up, man, oh man. I hope that's not a curse though. Yeah, just start. Sure Hopefully the camera works. You all good? Like Angle on everything good? Yeah, you can always just look at it. Just tap the screen. You want to see where you're filming. It's a process to fish, man. <laughs> Got to get all your cameras set up. An eight. Man, he's got a little deformity. All right, spot, largemouth. Are there smallmouth here? Man, these fish are about to pop, though. Yeah. Dude, they're just like meaty. There we go. Oh, I think it just jumped on a rock. You know how sometimes it falls down a rock and it feels like a, a bite? There we go. That's got to be a fish. Yeah. That one didn't. I think they have been spitting it, like you're saying. Kind of feels like a large. Well, it's good. Uh, nah. That's a big spot. Oh, man. Oh my god, that's a huge spot, dude. Yeah, dude. <laughs> that's a beautiful fish, dude. I'll take that. So funny, the air in their gut makes them look like they're freaking huge. <laughs> I'm holding it like a doofus. Yeah, not looking twice as big. Thank you, sir. Alrighty, dude. Well, thank you. Sir. All right. thank you. He's kind of beat up. Yeah, he does kind of well guys, going good so far as planned. The Kitek jig, green pumpkin red trailer. Mr. Bam's guru rod. Tried and true jig rod all year. Finesse jig rod that is. I think I'm snagged on line. It's gonna be impossible to get it out if it's online. We're donating to the lake a lot today. Zero to zero real quick. Dang. And I can tell the last time I used this jig was Clear Lake. It's got like green sludge on it. And my line's all green. Keeps the lake pretty cool, I would imagine. I bet you the spots are spawning up there when most large mounts are spawning in other lakes. Yeah. Hands on. The little Neddy. guy again. Ned Riggs getting the small ones. <laughs> We got a spot. Yeah, 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 yep. Still got some meat to him. Darker one. Yeah, chunky. 
gotta catch up to him. I can't tell. Uh, medium. Good keeper. Black and blue works too. Choke that one. They're definitely chewing. They're eating. Eating well. Yeah, I think Juan got like 400 or something for it. By like two pounds, I was so pissed. Feels like a little rat. Rat a tone. Yep. It works, guys. Yeah. It's. <laughs> yeah, that was. T oh. That was such a. Oh! It broke me off, dude. It broke me off. Wow. That was a good fish, dude. It was like. <laughs> what was that about? I must have had a jigger in my line from the copious amount of snags. Yeah, my line's frayed up, dude. Oh. I don't know if I want this craw trailer or not. Let's see. Do you want to cry after that teener on the delta? Oh, there we go. Why is my drag so loose? I got a fish as we're talking about Bam losing a teener on the delta. Not bad. Ooh. Yeah. No doubt about it. They throw up immediately after that fish got off. Way up there. Nice. You just spit up something. See that? Spit up like chunky something. Yeah, that's a fat one. Belly shirt. Big bullet. Yeah, shirt. <laughs> Two yonder. Two yonder. All right, guys, it's 12.30 right now. A little midday update. We caught a few. Bite's kind of tough. Nothing crazy yet. We're still looking for that giant. Warming up a little bit. Sun's coming out. I think we're just gonna wait for him to move up. Maybe try a different spot. We're gonna keep uh, grinding away. Going back to the old brown jig. And we're getting fights all the time. I, yep, there's a tree or two. Oh, and a sign, road sign. Is that what I'm stuck on? Oh God. I'm probably stuck on the other sign. Road sign underwater. I don't know. Just break, dude. It's coming, that's the thing that sucks, it's coming. That's got to be a whole tree. <laughs> 200 year old redwood. It's going to get to a certain point where you go to reach down for it, it's going to pull you in. Is it coming up or is it just pulling the boat towards it? This guy's probably like, what are these guys doing? There it goes. Wow. That's a giant, dude. <laughs> Woo! Biggest one of the day. I would be happy to buy you guys dinner if you had like a baby handful of, of uh, drop shot weights. I got one on a crankbait and the rest have been on a drop shot. Yeah, three sixteenths or quarters. So they'll... Drop shot, huh? I'm gonna have to tie one on now. Have you heard of those uh, hazadongs or whatever <laughs> Oh yeah. I That's just, what I got them. Everybody's You drop shot a hazadong shot? Yeah. Really? I brought, I brought some. I never actually caught one on one, but I was like, dang, those gotta look real well, good on the drop shot. Either these are the exact ones? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> so funny that I brought those. I was like looking through my tackle last night. I was like, oh, I made a big order of them too. Beautiful looking bait though. Yeah, it looks killer on a drop shot. It looks good. Look at that in the water though. I mean, you can only imagine what that looks like when you just pop your bait a little. That's crazy. Hold. It feels so strange. Little guy. Okay, so the Hazadong Shad works. So then it kind of ended with, you know, all right, I'm not going to wait around any longer. You might want to drop right into the boat. I'm, I'm not going to wait around no longer. It's like a non-issue, you know. <laughs> so, 
all good. I think it's, I totally understand, but it's just like just to communicate that. Do kind of drop the ball or kind of forget yourself. Good call, right under the boat. You can see the fish eat it right there. That's kind of cool. See that big old mark, and that's what comes <laughs> more down there. Right? Largey. See if you can see that on the graph while I'm dropping down. So I listened. You can see that fish as soon as my bait hit. You can see that fish come and eat it. Here's my bait again. I'll yeah. see if it's going to eat it. We might have it right now. It's in there. Video game fishing. They're wise though. They just saw their buddy get smoked. Yeah, that's. Did he ever sail in yet? No. Pull the grub. Come here, baby girl. Yeah. Yeah. He does, yeah. Argy. Nice one. Dude. Yeah. Good. What's up, baby girl? Barely had him. <laughs> cool. Weird spot. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap it up for us. Good day out on the water, nothing crazy. We didn't crush them, but we didn't skunk. Yeah, I mean, you know, some days it's on fire and some days it's not, we still got our fish. Can't complain, gotta thank Bam for uh, taking me out on the boat. Definitely a nice change to get out of the kayak, especially on these cold days where you really gotta go looking for these fish, you gotta find them. Bam's got a tournament here tomorrow, so uh, we'll, uh, we'll give him uh, good wishes. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the first fishing video of actually fishing of 2020. I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.